Hi there, my name is Russ Bowman and I'm an application engineer with Xair Corporation. Today, I'm going to show you how to identify an Xair cabinet cooler. For the purpose of this video, we're going to be focusing solely on the cabinet cooler unit itself. If you need help specifying a complete system, please call an application engineer. First off, cabinet coolers are offered in different NEMA ratings. NEMA 12 units have slender bodies and are recognized by a black or blue sleeve. The first two digits of these cabinet coolers part numbers will be 4-0. NEMA 4 and 4X units are larger around and have cylindrical metal bodies. The first two digits of these cabinet coolers part numbers will be 4-6. And the NEMA 4X will have an SS suffix as it's made of stainless steel. Cabinet coolers leave the factory with a small round sticker applied to the base. It's got a two digit number which will be the last two digits of the model code. Since this is a NEMA 4 cooler, its model number is 4625. If the sticker is no longer in place, we'll need to remove the generator. This is easy and quick, even if the cabinet cooler is still installed on an enclosure. You can remove the cold air distribution hose from the barbed adapter and unthread the cold fitting. It has a hole for a pen wrench to facilitate this. It doesn't really need to be much more than hand tight in the first place. The generator can then be removed. Take care not to lose the o-ring that holds it in place. Once removed, you'll find a code, two digits and a letter R, embossed in the brim of its top hat shape. If it's hard to see, you can use a flashlight for a better view, or the edge of a pencil or even a felt tipped marker to bring out the lettering. Since this generator is coming from a NEMA 4 cabinet cooler and the two digits shown are 30, this would be a model 4630. To reinstall the generator, simply reverse the steps required for removal. You can place the O-ring and the generator into the cold fitting, make sure the O-ring goes in properly, and tighten securely. The generator in a NEMA 12 unit is accessed from outside the enclosure. The main body is threaded into the cold end assembly. You can hold the cold end assembly's retaining ring with a pin wrench while loosening the main body. And the generator is removed. To reassemble, reverse the steps. Place the O-ring and generator on the cold end assembly and thread the main body back in place and tighten securely. To recap, the first two digits will be determined by the body style of the cabinet cooler. NEMA 12 units are 4-0, NEMA 4s are 4-6, and NEMA 4Xs are 4-6 with an SS suffix. The last two numerical digits are determined by the sticker at the base or the embossed code on the generator. If you have any questions or would like assistance in specifying a complete cabinet cooler system, contact an application engineer. Again, we're eager to help.